This is Scott with JSA Foundation Repair, and as you can tell, we have a nasty project. This brick wall was almost about to fall. These little tabs were holding it in. We went ahead and pulled it out and got the debris out of it. But as you can tell, this was on some fill dirt, and I'll get this side as well. All this brickwork was starting to, to pull away. If you guys can uh, real gently, let's kind of push this thing in. Hold it right there. Okay, right there it goes. Now, wedge it in as you guys were doing before. We're gonna to try to wedge this. There you go. And then what I wanna do is I wanna film this lift right here. We wanna we wanna close this gap all the way back up here, like right there. So, Brad, if you'll crank that machine right there, I'm gonna, it's perfect right there. I'm gonna go ahead and hand me that control. And we're gonna we're gonna film this thing coming up. Now here's the most important part. Push in on that right there at the top. Get it flush. Oh yeah, right there. Now let's see if we can get it come up a little bit. Push in a little bit more right on your side. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Now here we go. That's it. All right. Now you guys come on out there for just a second. Cut that machine off, Brett. Now, as you can tell, we're back plumb straight and level to the top. At the bottom, I'll do the caulking. I want to film this side right here as well. They have the same exact thing going over down here. I'll film this in a sec. We've dug the footing out. There is no footing. It's just on fill dirt. And as you can tell how much it's dropped, we've got a nasty situation on this side as well. We'll film that part. I'll finalize that, do a final video. And we'll just have to say another quad job done by JSA. This is Scott again with JSA. This is kind of a part two. Um, jacking up this center column down here. We already jacked that one over there and got it up. And then now we want to go ahead and show this gap over here and right there. And then I'm going to crank this machine. Let's see if we can go ahead and get this thing lifted up. We've already driven up here down about 15 odd feet or so. And now we just want to lift and see how this responds. And here we go. Okay, we'll this right here. Ready? Push your top end, Patrick, on that right side. Okay, right there. And that's it. I'm gonna cut the machine off real quick. Now, as you can see, we got the gap closed up. We got this pier in. We'll button everything up, do the mortar work. I'll do one last video on this system appearing for this garage. A middle column actually was okay in this case. It was just the two ends. Another quiet job done by JSA. Scott with JSA Foundation Repair. We are in Lilburn, Georgia, jacking up a brick column on a garage. Part of this video is to straighten the bottom out to get the pier in, press the pipe to close first that crack, and push the wall in because it's out about an inch and a half. And then we'll close that crack second. Most of my competitors kind of walked away from this job because they're not sure how to get in there and do that when there's no footing. And so we have a way that we do it. And Cam, if you'll go ahead and let's see if we can push this wall in and then we'll lift it up. First, let's show the wall going in. All right, push it in. Keep going real easy. There you go, a little bit more. All right, now I'm gonna show the lift of it. Go ahead and fire that machine up. And we're gonna show this lift right here. Okay, here we go. Hold that jack, you ready? Mm -hmm. All right. Straight. Okay, there's part one. And then we'll show part two of this lift in just a second. If you guys will put a board right here in the spacer and watch it see if it kicks out on the bottom. We'll see if we can lift this on up a little bit more. Okay, now let's see if we can show this lift. Make sure it don't kick out at the bottom cam. And there it goes, it's going, it's still going. 
I'll show the final video of that in just a second. Actually, I'll show part of the last video of that, and then we'll be able to lift it all back up. Scott, again, part two of this video, we've driven our pier down about 10 more feet. Now we want to show the final lift of this wall coming back up to close that gap in that mortar. Okay, go ahead and crank that machine. Y'all watch those sides, make sure everything's good. Put your hand right here and hold it. All right, here we go. There it is. Okay, cut it off. So as you can see, the first crack is gone. It was uh, right in here somewhere. Actually, it was right in here. And that crack is back to normal. We'll mortar that up, and I'll show the last part of the final mortar repair once it's completed. Scott, again with JSA. This is the final video. We've got the concrete poured back, the mortar put in at the top. That is actually an exact mortar match. It's just wet. Once it dries, it's gonna look perfect. And you can see the corner and the sides of this brick are perfectly straight now. So by the time we got it pushed in, lifted, raised, poured, and mortared, I can see why most people of the competitors didn't wanna do this job, but we got it taken care of. Another quad job done by JSA. This is Scott again with JSA Foundation and Mason Repair. It is August 4th, 2018, and we are going to jack this garage column over. It's got a nice bow in it, and we'll see if we can show a little bit of this video. Cam, if you'll go ahead and start cranking on that thing, let's see if we can get it to move a little bit. Keep going. There it goes. There it goes right there. All of it's going back in. Go as fast as you want. All right, hold on just a second. Sometimes you have to straighten up the mortar. All right, go ahead. Keep it going. Keep it going. All going back in. Go slower. Okay, keep going. Getting tight. Okay, hold it right there. Now what I want to do is I've got the wall fairly straight. We're going to go ahead and put some pins in there, and I'll do an after video. I just want to show how we move these walls back in place. I'll film part two in just a little bit. Scott Angle again with JSA Foundation Repair. Part two video. This is the after. As you can tell, it all came back in plumb straight and level, nice and straight and all the cracks are filled. This side I really didn't get a film of it. That was bowed out about two inches. Another quality job done by JSA. This is Scott with JSA Foundation Repair. Today is June 19th, 2015, and we are in Johns Creek, Alpharetta, Georgia. As you can tell, the customer has a three-car garage. And the center column has started to go down here, and it has actually pulled away as well and what we have done is we've installed a pier down here below the footing and now we're going to attempt to push the wall in and jack it up at the same time we'll see what happens here all right now we got it in let's see if we can get it up there it goes all the way back up all the way back up to the original position now we let go and it holds. Just wanted to say that what we'll do now is pour the concrete back, pin this wall, and do the necessary mortar work. Another quality job done by JSA. This is Scott with JSA Foundation and Mason Repair Specialists. We are in Mableton, Georgia, jacking up a brick column. I believe it's October 20th, 2017. Customer called us out because they have a typical, typical garage here that you can tell has settled on the right side and we have taken pipe and driven it down about 20 some odd feet to a bearing point that's going to hopefully lift this thing back up. The customer had put a steel rod in right there to kind of hold this in place and uh, 
you know, good thing they did that that kept the wall from falling away so now we're going to go ahead and try to use our machine here and uh see if we can jack this up brett if you'll hold that wall in at the top and i'm going to give you the phone just hold it as steady as you can i'll be down here for, uh, moving the other part all right are you ready Now, what you see, video cut off there, this is part two. You can see how much that brick wall came all the way back up. And we'll do the necessary pinning and mortar work and get this wall back into the house here shortly. Another quality job done by JSA.